And we are so thrilled to welcome back a friend that has been a big part of our show for so many years. We love her. You know and love her from PBS. Her 19 years on PBS. Currently, her show is called Lydia's Kitchen. Of course, I'm talking about the one and only chef and restaurateur and TV celebrity, Lydia Bastianich. Welcome back, chef. My pleasure. Nice to see you, darling. Mm, mm, nice. And this side. And ah. this side. How many books are already gone, Mr. Sean? 600 of your books are already gone. Oh, good beginning. Now, this is your 11th cookbook, my darling. It is. And it is also a celebration of Italian food, but also special occasions, right? Well, it is. How do you celebrate in the Italian style? Exactly. And this is all about, well, a celebration. We're going to have. We need some Prosecco. We're going to start with some Prosecco. That's one and, of the nicer sounds in the world, I have to say. And this is one of the recipes because the book begins also with aperitivi and a uh, uh, little, um, let me put this down here. Here, let me help with that. Oh, you got it? That's okay, it. So this is strawberry uh, liqueur with all the fruits and a little Prosecco and you got yourself a great Bellini. Oh. Okay, we'll begin with that. And, and Lydia, as you pour that, I need ooh. to let everyone know this, like every item in our show today on air and online, is five easy payments or better. That means your new Lydia Bastianich cookbook, and there are 220 recipes, is five payments of $4.39. We're getting very busy on the phones. Uh, life is short. Shall we have a sip of cocktail first? Absolutely. Now, what would you like? I have a limoncello martini. Well, I, you I try, have the, you the, try the, um, the. And sangria. Which one do you well, want? Well, there are so many. Let's, I'm going to do the limoncello. The limoncello martini. Salute, chin chin. Yes, and to your health, my friend. Okay. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. So this is Italian style beginning of all these kind so of light. So lovely and light. light. Yes. Light aperitivi. Italian aperitivis are light. Now, my darling, what could be more <laughs> appropriate coming from you, chef, than lasagna? You know, lasagna, people, everybody loves it, and everybody thinks that it's such a big chore, and it really isn't. And it is one of those great dishes mm -hmm. that, you know, you can make double, triple, you make two, three, four and of these. And freeze them. You can freeze them, you can get, and then, look. Oh, okay. I'm about to eat Lydia Bastianich's lasagna. Okay. Ellis. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> are you, are you? Oh, and we have a little cheese here. We have a grater here for some cheese. Yes. Absolutely. You oh. have your fork. I'll get, I'll do the oh, work. Oh, you do the, okay. I'll do the work. You, you are so the, good to me, chef. You, you do the eating. Oh, I, 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 I can do that. Okay. Oh, perfect. Okay. Oh, chef, so this, this is, this smells is, amazing. Uh, a, a tomato and ricotta and grana padana lasagna. Very mm. simple. Layers oh, of pasta. Oh, cheese. <laughs> and you can feed out of this 12, 16 people mm. easy. Mmm, it's heaven. It's <laughs> heaven. It's worthy of the happy dance. Yes, come on, get the happy dance. Should I do it with oh, you? Oh, of course you should. <laughs> All right, 1,200 of these are gone. Now, Lydia, how many restaurants in New York City, my darling? Six in Six. New York City. My I... favorite is your Becco. Becco by, in the theater district. In the theater district. Yeah, that goes You good. must go to Becco if you are going to see a Broadway show. You must make reservations at Lydia's Becco, your trio of pastas at yes, Becco. Yes, unlimited pasta. I love it. And we have I eat lasagna. them out of house and home when I'm there. <laughs> um, all right, chicken pie. Parmesan. You know, chicken parmesan is one of those mm. favorites. And again, people think, well, maybe. Could I make it for 20? Of course you can. It's easy. You know, you did the eggplant. Not right. so much different. Right. The breading. But what I do here in this recipe is instead of kind of soaking it up with tomato sauce, I make a fresh tomato, chopped up Ooh, light nice. tomato sauce. Perfect. Yeah. Nice and mm. crispy. And the tomato makes it fresh. Oh, it's perfect. So wonderful. Oh, Lydia, it's just so... <clears throat> Perfect balance of flavor. It's also not greasy, no. which I so appreciate about good chicken parm. Yeah. Now, let me take a look inside the book. I want everyone to see your gorgeous book inside. Okay. Because if you know Lydia's show, you know she teaches as she cooks, sharing with you so many uh, background stories when it comes to all of the, uh, the great uh, recipes. You this see, is a, a butternut squash risotto. Butternut squash. And you see the big bowl? That's enough for 20 people, and mm. you can make it easy. Look at this. Gorgeous photos. Mmm, pastas. 
and great, easy to follow recipes. Mm. The most important thing here is that all of Lydia's recipes are teaching you a lesson as you go through. You're learning, this is crispy shrimp. You're learning all about the great regions that these, uh, regions of Italy these come from. And you'll love the fact that Lydia has written now 11 books sharing her wonderful insight to classic Italian cooking. Rosa Buco. Everybody oh. loves that. Isn't and it that's crazy? easy to make. Big pot. 2,000 books are gone. Look at turkey breast with apricots. How lovely would that be for Thanksgiving? Absolutely. Well, absolutely. You take the whole turkey. And, and look at this dear picture up. on the back. I love my Lydia. She's so playful and fun. It's a perfect photo of you on the back. <laughs> it if, is. You, if you don't know, you need to know that this is a very playful lady. She is a lovely person and she is a master cook, but she's also darling. All right, so this is ravioli. This is ravioli. This takes a little bit of doing, and that's great if you want an inclusive party. You have the ladies over and you want to kind of make the pasta with them. The and stuff what's, in, what's in the ravioli? It's cacio, pecorino, Pacho is pecorino. Mm -hmm. It's grana padano cheese and fresh grated pears. It's delightful. Isn't it? You get the beautiful savory of the cheese and the sweetness of the pears. It's simple. And then the sauce is just a little bit of the cheese melted in a little bit of cream, oh. with fresh pepper, and grated grana. Are these little baby pizzas? Yes. And that makes for a great party, especially when you have kids. Oh, so you lovely. make the dough, you cut the shape of the pizza, and you make all the stuffings. So I see caramelized onions, fresh tomatoes, cheeses, there's hair and blue cheese, it looks like. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Mm. And, and these are great appetizers or mm. a great party in itself. Nice They're so and light and perfect. Yeah, and you know, everybody thinks, oh, I need a pizza oven. No, you can make these in your regular oven. Life is short. Let's eat dessert first. <laughs> 2,700 of these are now gone, getting very, very busy. All right, so let's take a look at your chocolate cake, but this is something special. Tell us about this. It's a chocolate zabaglioni cake, mm. and it's the chocolate cake, very simple, made with cocoa, and then you make a chocolate mousse, again, very simple, with egg yolks, and, right. and, and then you put the amarena cherries in it. Chocolate oh. and cherries go good, but amarena cherry is very, mm. uh, very Italian. You know, the flavor mm. is very Italian, and you buy them in a jar just mm. like that, would you like a little more? Sure. Some uh -huh. more cherries. Cherries and sauce and oh. You know what? I have to say, I have the very best job in television. I am a lucky okay. man. Okay. This is amazing. I will tell you, 3,000 books are gone. Five easy payments on your credit card. Please don't miss this book. It is absolutely amazing. Shipping out on October. 17th, and I would imagine you have quite a book tour in front of you. Do you not? I do, I do. I'll be around to Chicago, all the cities I'll go. And do all the big TV shows. Do, yes, the morning show, the TV show. So we'll be show. watching you yeah, and, and can't wait. It is so lovely to have you back, friend. It's so excited. Come and to see be us here. again when you can. I know you're a busy lady, but we love having you here. Okay. Everybody, Lydia Bastianich, how wonderful. Ciao. Thank you so Ciao. much. Ciao. And this cake is amazing. All right, we'll see you soon. And best of luck with the book. Okay, have Ooh, a nice time. Those pizzas are so good. All of it's so delicious. Now, coming up is our one day only uh, priced item. And this is really extraordinary because what we're going to do is show you how you can take something tough like a flank steak, hit this with your seasoning or prior to your marinade.